Prince Harry finds himself in hot water following revelations from his memoir, Spare, where he admitted to past drug use, including cocaine, magic mushrooms, and cannabis. These admissions have sparked controversy in the U.S., leading to a heightened demand for the disclosure of his visa application details. This demand is fueled by concerns over whether his drug use could affect his immigration status, as U.S. law can be strict on such admissions for those seeking entry into the country. Amidst the turmoil, sources suggest Prince Harry might be regretting the revelations that have not only caused personal embarrassment but also potential diplomatic discomfort for the Biden administration. In response to the public outcry, there have been calls to make the Duke of Sussex's visa records public, a move strongly resisted by U.S. authorities. U.S. Ambassador to the U.K., Jane Hartley, has affirmed that such actions will not occur under the current administration. Meanwhile, the conservative think tank, the Heritage Foundation, has intensified its legal efforts to obtain these records, incorporating Harry's drug use comments as a basis for their case. As these challenges unfold in the U.S., Prince Harry reportedly seeks to mend ties with the British royal family. His intentions appear geared towards a reconciliation, particularly as the royal family faces its own set of challenges. Additionally, Harry is preparing for a significant personal milestone, planning a return to the UK in May to celebrate the 10th anniversary of his Invictus Games organization. This combination of personal reflection and public controversy comes at a time when both Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's popularity is reportedly waning. They have been advised to rejuvenate their public image by openly addressing their struggles and redefining their brand, both in the UK and the US. As the couple navigates these complex issues, their next steps could be crucial in shaping their future public acceptance and roles.